So I need to get lovebirds. Hide nearby to observe the lovebirds. Oh, God. And get the pipes. That's it, right? Letters of transit. I can only get out of the town. Okay, that's the main quest, I believe. And Thomasina house. Get into the Thomasina house. Make yourself throw up. Oh, okay. Whoa, Lady Robin Hood. Thank you so much for them bits. Drop them bears, guys. Everybody drop them bears. Y'all are the sweetest. All right, I think I'm going the wrong way, actually. Let's go this way again. Oh, man. They're having milk and Oreos for a snack. Oh, God, that sounds so good. That sounds so dang good. All right. I'm going to go straight this way. You take your joy Shut up, TV. Why are TVs, like, the worst in this game? Constantly blowing up my spot. Right, don't mind me. Don't mind me. Alright, I keep going. Just a little bit further. And then we'll take a, a I believe a left. Right? Yeah, okay. So, oh, I gotta observe the lovers. Observe the lovers. Oh god, don't be a creep, Arthur. <gasps> oh! Oh! They're not getting on very well, are they? I wonder if I can help him. Oh, Benedict, you just came on too strong. Funny. You smell important. Yes, I'm a chemist, and I've invented a new cologne. I call it Mojo. It makes you smell like a doctor. You see, Beatrice has always had a what? soft spot for doctors. This is and dumb. You know how they have that distinctive smell. Do they have a distinctive Mojo smell? Makes you smell like that. And it works? Not on Beatrice. Doctors are much nicer to me, but she is not. Have you tried giving her flowers? She only likes night blooming non suches. And where would I get those? At In night. The district. Right. Well, good luck then. <laughs> I have some for you. Don't I have some already? I thought I had some, right? That's a lily bulb. Grunt. Um, did I use it? I must have accidentally used it. All right, I'll come back for you, buddy. Don't you worry. Are you Beatrice? Lovely weather. Oh, hello. Aren't Are you, you tall? tall? Oh, scandalous. Oh, I suppose I am a little. There's room for two on this bench, you know. Oh, yes. Oh, I suppose I could. To not be so tall and all. I love to come here and read. Oh shit! Do you like books? Yes. yes. Who doesn't? I'm. Uh, I've been collecting a lot of books recently, uh, in the gar in the garden district, if you can imagine. Oh, that's so brave of you. Ah, oh, they're not really cannibals, you know. You just have to talk to them. But don't they bring you down? Oh, <laughs> well, I suppose they would if I listened. <laughs> you must tell me all about your adventures. I'd love to. I mean. Oh, goodness. I have to go see a chap. Do you have to? Oh, I... I sort of have to get back to the parade. Don't know when I'll be back. Hard to make predictions, especially about the future. Huh. Oh, come back any time. Dude, we got on with her a lot better than this guy with his doctor cologne. Also, come on, let's, let's, let's talk about this. A cologne that makes you smell like a doctor? What the fuck is that about, right? Oh, let's go to the Shady Dealer real fast. Alright, so we take a right, and then we take a left. Okay. Dude. We're about to sneak up on that lady. And be like, hey, how's it going? I'm Arthur. I go to the Garden District. No big deal. No big deal at all. I'm somewhat important. Oh. He's in one of these alleys. Ah, he's in this alley. Hi, 
buddy. What's your fancy today? God, I love how you're in here. Alright, uh, let's sell some shit. Alright, what can we sell? What can we sell? We got a lot of these bandages. Let's go down to 20 bandages. I guess 15 bandages. We can always make more. I get so, like, eager to sell things that I'm like, oh yeah, let's just sell some of these until we get to this. Oh, shit, I've already passed that point. <clears throat> um, all right, we have 90. 90 smackaroonies. What's this? Water filter. Sick up tea. So there's a lot of stuff I have. I don't really need to be carrying, but it's nice to carry them. Use in crafting. Okay, so I don't want to sell those. Hmm. Got a lot of these short specs I want to keep. Right, let's go back to your shop. Boy, the suit, gas mask, broken helmet. All right, a lot of those things we've bought. This, I should buy by a few of these. How much is that one again? I'm just gonna buy all of them because those are really important. The best right. is the enemy of the good, eh? All right, let's boogie. So, take a right, take a left. Okay. Am I going the right way? Yeah, a little left. Okay. Just making sure I'm going the right way. Okay, watch out for those alley doctors. Oh, dude, I know. I still haven't seen a doctor, thank God. That's what they're called, doctors. They're like the bad, bad guys. Still haven't seen one yet. Well, I, I have seen one, but I haven't seen seen one. And oh my god. Hey, yeah. <laughs> oh, lovely. Wah. Swish. Pow. <laughs> Are you lovely. supposed to be doing lovely. that? Is she supposed to be doing that? I don't think you're supposed to be doing that, buddy. I think the fog has actually gotten worse. Okay. Oh. Talk to Mrs. Pankhurst. Oh, hello, love. Come stomp in the puddle with me. <laughs> it's ever so much fun. Good lord, that's Motteline. One spark and she's going to incinerate herself. I've got to get her attention somehow. Maybe a lot of pretty flowers would do it. Oh, I gotta find so many night blooms. What time is it? It's 3.52. Okay, we're almost night. It's almost night. So uh, we'll come back and get her. Oh. So she's literally playing in gasoline. Is that what's being implied? She's just having a good time in a bunch of gasoline. Okay, um... Am I supposed to equip it? Let's see. Ah, ah, here we go. Fill the bucket. Handy little sucker. <laughs> Have I got any power cells? I could fill them up too. Oh. Can I not have just sucked up that stuff for her? Can we just not suck it up? Can we just suck up what she's dancing in? Let's just try that. Let's just try sucking up what she's dancing in. Let's get my mask back on. Uh, mask, 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 mask. Uh, here we go. Mask. Oh, that's a real nasty piece super, isn't it? Um. 
Okay, I can't actually just give it to her. Okay, we can't just suck that up. It would've been nice if we could, right? Alright, let's, uh, let's head back to Dr. Faraday. I really want to go see Roger and, uh, what's that guy's name? Those boys that she's living with, because they are amazing and cute. She is like a little kid, but she's like jumping up and down in gasoline. This is the equivalent of a, a gasoline firefight in a, or a gasoline fight in a Zoolander. That's an awful lot of bobbies. Right, we're just gonna go straight this way. I think this is the fastest way down there. Shut up, TV. Fuck you, TV. I think I deactivated this? Yeah, I deactivated this. That's awesome. Alright. Cool. This guy is still drunk from that scotch. I love it. Jack Wording, that's me at the broadcast tower at the well, I'm not sure what they have you know. Of course we've got it. It's time for the secret word of the day. Alright, so this is where I came in, right? Right here? Yeah, right here. Okay, cool. Let's get back to this place. Let's open this bad boy up. Let's go back to where we came from. Bobbies can't hold their scotch. It's true, but like, we gave him a stupid amount of scotch. Um, I'm gonna upgrade these stations, because I can. Oh, that's a chemistry station. I want to upgrade these because I feel like if we have a upgraded station that we can always go to, it'd be awesome, especially in an um, underground vault. This one seems to be like, it could be really worthwhile for us. Alright, um, all right, so let's put back on my torn suit. There we go. And let's go to the town. How do I get there from here? Ah, here it is. It's this one. Okay. So we're gonna go all the way back here, back here, back here, back here, back here. So honeybee nest, bloody rock. Faraday lives over here. Okay, so let's go here. I don't have that hatch? Oh shit. Okay, let's get that hatch. You can't fast travel from this location? I should be able to. I can't fast travel from this location? What the fuck's wrong? Why can't I travel to these locations? Ugh, that's just shitty. So I can go to and from this place, but I can't leave? That's just butts. Now I'm gonna waste a bunch of time walking back and forth. Ugh. That's dumb. Ugh. Ugh, such a long walk. I can't even run. Bitches. This is so dumb. Man, what's the point of having fast travel? You can't go back and forth. Sh shut up, TV. Alright, well. Take the long walk back. The long walk back. Isn't there a way for me to, like, sneak out of here? I feel like there's a way for me just to sneak out of here. 
Seems like a lot of these uh, places are like locked up with cages and stuff. Oh, I'm getting there. There's a lot of the downer incidents. All right, let's take a left here. Downer breach. It's so bad. Such a weird society. Right, 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 right. So. Can I leave from this way? I think there was a way for me to leave. Like, I could just, like, scoot out of the town through this, like, little corner. I guess if we keep going this way, we'll get it. We'll get there. Do, do, do. Out of the way. Man, I can't wait till I can get the perk to just allows me to run in town. And people don't freak out when I run. That'd be nice. See, Arthur, you're doing a really good job at holding in your crazy. Oh, this guy is totally drunk. Look at him. So drunk. Oh, that's right. Okay, go through here. So this one? Aha! Okay, now we change my clothes. There we go. Now we run all the way to Dr. Faraday. So there's a hatch over here we could probably try to use. Let's try to use this hatch. If we can't use it, then we'll just fucking have to walk. Which is butts. Wait, no. Oh, Faraday is actually really close. She's just like right over here. I'm getting old. Oh shit, I can't go that way? Okay. Mm, can't go that way. Definitely can't go that way. What the butts? How did I end up back here if I can't get out of it? Faraday. She's down here. <sighs> you hope I feel better, Rainbow Girl? That sounds, that's very nice of you to say. Thank you so much. We've just had a very long trip. And Pax is always exhausting. Never without its moments, though. There we go. Jesus. Here it is. Oh my god. We're back. We're gonna see Roger. And that one dude, so I can't remember his name. Derek? Is it Derek? I think it's Derek. Let's see. Oh, it's jammed. James! Oh, it's James. Roger and James. Oh, I love them so much. Roger and James. What up? There's the bucket. Hi. I got your stuff. Brilliant. Thank you. I didn't dare ask those idiots out there. They'd only set themselves on fire again. Um, what do you need it for? I've been working on a wormhole device, you see. A wormhole device? Well, don't you look puzzled. Spent science class mooning after a girl, did you? They said it was dangerous. Ha! <laughs> Ridiculous. It's perfectly safe for the most part. You have a device that makes, uh, a portal of some kind? <laughs> the, the, the going in the whole bit works. Theoretically, I can come out a second hole on the other side of the river. 
I just need a few particular mechanical pieces. Oh my god. That's how I'm getting out. How are you getting out? Oh, simple really. I just need to get to St. George, get a letter of transit, go to the parade and cross the Britannia Bridge without being arrested or shot full of joy by a doctor. Excellent. Here, you'll need this device. I marked the cars that have the parts I need. Well, off with you. Playing with portals now. My goodness. Oh god, what the fuck is this? Extractor. Alright guys. Uh, hold on tight guys, I'll be right back, okay? Don't go anywhere. Alright guys, sorry about that. I'm back. Let's get back into this game. Ooh. Excuse me game, why are you not picking up? Oh, I want this one. There we go, that's the one I want. That's the one I want. There we go, we're here guys. We're here, we're back. Oh, man. Just need to take some aspirin and get some more water. I Ash ended up getting the Pax Pox, which is really unfortunate because he's such a sweet boy that doesn't. I hope this isn't too loud. Who doesn't need to get sick? But you know, I don't want it. Oh my God, that's loud. The fuck, Arthur? You okay? I should have said. How have you been all these years, Sally? You ran off into the night with nothing, and now you're some sort of brilliant chemist. How did you survive? I wish I could have helped you. It'd be nice to be friends again, instead of all those dreadful things. Ah, uh, man, Arthur, you really fucked up. You've been fucking up left and right, buddy. Anyways, back to what I was originally saying is, uh, I'm trying to take care of myself because Ash got the the Pax flu. Oh. Okay. How many cars am I supposed to get? Man in house. Dig spot. Dig spot cellar. Man in house. She said she marked the cars. There's one there. And where's the other car at? There's obviously a car up here. Strap bits from the car near the old Lump station and near the treehouse. Okay, so I'm going to that one first, and then we'll have to turn around. Okay. <laughs> yeah, he got the concrud. It sucks. He's a. Uh, he's all sneezy and sniffly, and he's just feeling sick. He'll get better though. I'm trying myself to keep away from him as much as possible because I do not want to get sick. Also, what is this tree house? 
No girls allowed. So uh. that's where I parked it. <laughs> Why'd you take the banana? You know Let's it go over there. You. How could you forget that? Bomb inside rat bottom. Key with secret hole. Top secret. Amphibian breathing apparatus. Air tube guns. Bomb briefcase. Disguise techniques. No hat, no spectacles, no false mustache. Ha! Huh. It's great. Oh! What? You built a lovely tree house. Mine was never this grand. Welcome to the Special Operations Executive. You're the new agent, aren't you? Alfie, what's his name? Great. Here are the other agents. This is Charlie Croker, <laughs> Jack Carter, <laughs> Gonville Bromhead, Joe Vandeleur, and Nigel Powers. Hi. But we're missing Peachy. Peachy Carnahan. Oh, I have He's Peachy. He's been kidnapped. And you have to rescue him. All right? Brilliant. Here's everything you need to rescue Peachy. The house they're keeping him in is pretending to oh, be a I puppet theater. Oh, I have Peachy. But it's really a den of spies. Well, that's one way to stay sane out here. But I got Peachy. Brilliant. Knew we could count on you, Alfie. Hey, everybody, Peachy's back. Peachy's back, look, guys. Charlie Croak has been wounded. He <gasps> needs a first aid kit. Can you get one? Is it just duct tape? I knew you could. Here's the top secret blueprint for making one. Okay. And you can find the ingredients on this map. Cool. I suppose you do have to look out for your friends. Okay. Do I have the first aid stuff? Let's see. Medicated bomb. Oh. Do I not have antiseptics? I must use all my antiseptics. Oh, well, that's easy to do. Can I borrow it with you? Thank goodness you survived your mission. Yes, Keep thank up goodness. The good work. Okay. The free will depends on you. All right. Well, that's pretty cool. No girls allowed, guys. Special operations executive. This guy never grew up. Who was that? Who was that? That rainbow girl just subscribed for two months in a row. Thank oh you so much, rainbow girl. God damn, this is loud. Too old to go to Germany, are you not? No, no. I'm not going to put one more child on that train. Oh. <laughs> At least we're getting more of Arthur's backstory now. Oh, God. I don't think I like this device at all. What, you don't like the fact that it... It fucking just makes you have bad memories? Hmm? That's kind of your fault, Arthur. Look, it's fine. We understand you got PTSD. We're here for you, buddy. Okay, has to be a night. Okay. Sadness. The saddest of nisses. It's true. It, it, this is kind of depressing, though. The fact that he's having, like, his memory suppressed for, like, years and years because of that pill, and... It's all just... Bum... We'll bumming out. Later. All these things. I really don't need any more crons. I have a lot of crons. I haven't really been eating any of them. I, I would like some more roses of Gilead if I can I find some. To run the bases. Natty Lynn, you're lurking. Austin Seattle Packs, dude. I'm so happy we met. Welcome. Maybe I should sit down for a bit. Right now we're just playing something happy fever. I think we're gonna switch over to uh, Two Point Hospital in a bit. Right now I'm just running around ca gathering items for this quest. Yeah, I wish I kept in shape. Oof. How's it going, boys? You can't have our water. I don't want your water. Fuck off. I don't want your water. Yeah, like I want your water. Your water's nasty. Oh, seeking water. <laughs> What's her? Yeah, I am a bit hungry and thirsty. All right, let's eat something. Uh, eat one of these. 
Eat one of these. Sweet. Okay. Perfect. Okay, here's the last car. Do I really have to extract three bits? Wouldn't two do? Hmm. Oh dear. Alright, let's do this. It's so loud. Did that not oh, work? Dear. Oh, did I accidentally do it too early? There we go. Finished. Uh, are you going to hurt us? No one's going to hurt you, Percy. I, I promise. But... We're brothers. I'll look out for... We'll look out for each other. <sighs> I think I had a terribly keen grasp on how many unpleasant things I've forgotten. <sighs> Have I opened this hatch up? Possibly I didn't. There's a lot of bad memories here. Oh yes, okay, yeah. I opened that one up. Good. That was the one that was filled with those, um... Like, zombie-like tweakers. All right, so Dr. Faraday is that way. So let's go back to your... Let's collect some night blooms on the way back, because then I won't have to worry about it later. There we go, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Actually... Go home and go to bed. Let's see. What the fuck was that? <laughs> it was a duck. Why is the duck going that way? Duck, you're supposed to go the other way. Duck, you're supposed to go this way, buddy. Go that way, buddy. What the hell? <laughs> Sorry to bother. <laughs> you don't even care about your friend? That guy doesn't really care about his buddy. Oh, just relax. Don't question it. There's no murderer here. Just trying to free free open the the watering hole. That duck. My duck back. You're rubbish at hide and seek. What the fuck are you doing? Not as invisible. You want to do this? No. Come on. This is for you. Come on. Come on. Come on. End it. Alright. You're never going to go anywhere. You're stuck in the fucking ground. I'm gonna take all the water I want. <laughs> Alright, do I need to kill you? Crap. They don't come back. They never coming back. I just break this. Oh sneak. Let's see. Do, you, do one of you guys have a key? Let's see. Lockpick. I actually think you owed me a bit of money. You didn't have anything? Okay. Now, this guy... Is there anything I can do to kill you? Can I throw a rock at your face? 
What the hell? Maybe a dart. Get you bleeding. Christ almighty. Oh, bloody hell. Come on, guy. Why don't you bleed? Bleed for me. Dream, it's time. How do I get you to bleed? Let's just, let's just come back here. Maybe I want him to like bleed to death. Come to the end of our time. We've come to the end of our time. Has he just spouted Jack quotes? Uncle Jack quotes? He seems to be. All right. I've got better things to do than chase your ass across town. What oh. the fuck was that? Man. How do I just knock you out, buddy? Uh, uh, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> what the fuck am I doing? You can't just call it a victory. A victory is when you win. Get dead, you stupid rubbish goblin! Rainbow girl, thank you for the bits. There you go. Dead. What have we come to? Dude, you are the worst. All right, now I can pick this dumb luck. God damn it, that guy. Just hide in that rubbish pile. All right, so let's fill our canteens. We have a lot of canteens to fill. There we go. I'm just filling up all these canteens that we have. We have so many of them. And then we're gonna take a little drink from one of them. All right, we're good. All right, let's go to Dr. Faraday now. We have all the stuff that we need. Figure we might as well just open up that canteen for us because we'll be needing a lot of that water eventually. A beautiful girl and jovial laugh. <laughs> I did think we used to run the hydration. Hydration is important, it's true. <gasps> oh yeah. I need these. It was a hard winter when Perfect. Whoa. Wow, he truly did fix that. That James really fixed that thing. James, are you okay, buddy? Oh, there's Roger. How's it going, Roger? What happened to Roger? Or what happened to James? There you go. Press the button. Yeah, he really fixed it, right? Did you get everything? Brilliant. You got a knack for these things. So rare these days. Everyone expects everything to just work on magic. That's perfect. I just need to make the final adjustments. Tell you what, come back tomorrow and I'll pop out of here through my wormhole and fix your precious bridge. Oh, thank you. Oh, okay. Merit, welcome back. We're trying to figure out what happened to James. Oh. Where'd he go? As long as there are three left, in weeks they'll be done. What the fuck? What the hell oh, was that? Yeah. I hope she's all right. Maybe I should go check. Um, is she okay? Is she dead? Oh, Roger and James. Oh. Oh, for heaven's sake, she's gone! I can't believe she left without helping me. Oh. Well, I can. I just feel like a complete idiot trusting her. Do I want to come in here? Okay. Sovereign. Grab that sovereign. Put that. Charcoal bits. Might as well. Is there anything else in here that I might need? Modest proposal? Dear Helen, we of the executive committee do not understand why you are so upstanding. 
or obstinate about the prototype mask we requested. It's not like you're Harry Hathworth talking about reshaping people's heads so they feel better. We're not asking you to run the wires yourself. That is the job of Dr. Bridgewell at the Health. We're simply asking you to rig up a happy face mask with microfilament wires that can be run through the eye cavity and through the optic nerve. So a mild current can be applied to the pressure center of the brain. Brain. <laughs> pressure center of the brain. The brain! Ah, yes, we discovered the various difficulties with Mr. Arkwright. We're not saying all the wrinkles have been ironed out. It's an experimental prototype. You've done such fine work for the Bridges and the Spankers, in spite of the objections that they would have turned Wellington Wells into some sort of police state, which you can easily see they have not. Uh, no, that's not right. That's, that's, look, false, false. Uh, we can't, we really don't see why this is on your hill to die on. So please, do please let us know when you're ready to see reason. Yours truly, Beatrice Reeve, Executive Committee, Broadcasting Tower 1 of the Operated Up Home. For mm. Christ, they want to electrify the masks. Are we all supposed to carry power cells in our hats? Are they completely insane? Yes, they're completely insane. Arthur, we've known this. They're completely insane. Thanks for all your help. You'll go far one day, which is more than I could say for the other Nupties. I don't know what they do to break the bridge, but 9 out of 10, I turn it off and turn it off back on again. <laughs> That's a trick. <laughs> so do that. You'll need a code to operate the switch. It's 1492. Nine times out of 10, if I turn it off and turn it back on again, that does the trick. Oh, for heaven's sake. All this for that. Oh, for fuck's sake. For fucking fuck's sake. Now I can cross the bloody bridge to St. George and find Sally's house and go grovel. <laughs> <laughs> Just turn it back off and on again. Man, everything is like fucked up. James! <gasps> Roger's gone! Oh, wait, there he is. Roger! I want to talk to you! Lovely day for it. Roger, you're so smashing and so handsome. What happened to James, though? Oh, well.